What is up, you guys? Welcome back to another day, another adventure. I'm Devi, served my adventure. I'm an Orlando based flight attendant for a US airline, getting ready to go to work. I'm just kind of like refreshing my curls a little bit. I normally sleep with my hair in a scrunchie, and I didn't last night. I have curly hair naturally, so it was looking a little crazy at the root. I figured I would just touch them up really quick before I go in. We are working a Cleveland turn today. Super easy. I'm pretty sure I'm working with a San Juan crew. I think that's going to be as good as that part's going to get. But we are working cabin position today. So I will be in the middle just talking away with the passengers, helping them find their seat. It's um 11:25 and depending on traffic we will either need to leave at 12 or 12 30. okay since i'm working lunch and dinner time i'm going to heat up some of this like southwest veggie soup super easy from ollie and then i have one of these soup containers i have hot water in here right now this is going to keep the soup hot for many 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 hours i'm just gonna throw this in the microwave and i actually need to leave probably in the next 10 minutes this is gonna take me 50 minutes to get to work final touch for breast cancer awareness month i have no idea how full these planes are but the plane isn't even going to be here for another 20 minutes honestly i mean it's big enough to tie a freaking bow okay zhuzh this up a little bit does it look like a bit much i think it's fine for now honestly um we are on the ground here in cleveland there's like checked in 190 sold and yeah we just have one flight back should be two others again and we'll be good to go okay it's like that we are back in orlando i got to work with a san juan crew today which never happens i never get to work with them just because we aren't ever on the same pairings but it seems like now that we've become a turn model and there's no flights on tuesdays and wednesdays ever when there is a flight on a tuesday and wednesday it's given to another bay it's friday we got the next two days off it's not really friday it's my friday we have wednesday thursday off i ain't got plans tomorrow we'll probably just be cleaning the house and then thursday uh we have an eye doctor appointment Two. We got our coffee ready. I ran out of small glass straws. I need to order some more on like Amazon or something. We are just gonna add our pumpkin swirl cookie. This is the natural bliss pumpkin cookie. Natural bliss oat creamer pumpkin swirl cookie. Okay, as an adult, we have access to adult money. And I have a gorgeous Wednesday being wasted away in my house cleaning. What else should I do on a Wednesday rather than go and spend my adult money? We officially got a swig in Claremont and I don't want to say I live next door to Claremont, but I mean, I live close enough to where it's not that far from me. So you and me are gonna go on an adventure to swig. We're supposed to be there at 125. It's only like 20 miles for me, so it's nothing crazy. I'm curious to see how nuts the line is gonna be, and everything is made with Dr. Pepper, and I am such a Dr. Pepper girl through and through. And I wanna get multiple drinks made with Dr. Pepper, and they're known for their cookies, so I would also like to get some cookies. We are in line at 121. I just downloaded the Swig app. It's actually moving pretty fast. All right. How are you today? Hi, how are you? Good, thank you. Um, can I do a 32 ounce Rain King? So a kid's naughty and nice. And then, do you guys have the pretzels? Okay, can I do pretzels and the white cheese? Um, and then I have a free sugar cookie. So far, grand opening, we'll probably get a hang of that, but for now, we can just get a free cookie. Oh, okay. All right, you're all set. Thank you. Thank you so much. Sorry. <laughs> and here are the pretzel bites and the white cheddar cheese. And then a cookie. 
A cookie? I ordered a sugar cookie. Oh, come on. <laughs> Thank you. Of course, you have a great rest of your day. You too. They didn't give me napkins. I got... I'm so excited! I don't know if you're supposed to shake it or not. Why do I feel like this is not... I feel like this is the 44 ounce. It says 32. Taste test. <gasps> wow, that's magical. We have to take a photo. I went to Swig since it's really close to where I live. So this was the Rain King. This is strawberry vanilla cream and of course Dr. Pepper because I am a DP girl. This is the 32 ounce. I really just wanted to take a photo with the cup so that's why I got it so big. Body or Nice which is English toffee half and half and Dr. Pepper. I'm glad I got a kid size of the sugar cookie because it was free. Pretzel bites and cheese, the part I'm most excited about. It's not any ends, but it's pretty good and we don't have a Sonic by us. So I can't get pretzel bites anywhere unless I go to like Disney Springs or get them at the airport at any ends. I'll give the pretzel bites a six out of 10. The Rain King gets a 12 out of 10. It's not and nice, gets a seven out of 10. Fetch this. Talk All about right. an experience you have. Next, like, we have like, Target errands like, to get. How long this takes, because it took me 40 minutes to get here, which is not horrible because I was in Claremont. And I also realized that Claremont has all of the drink drive throughs I wonder if I talked about this last night, but they have seven brew coffee, which I always see on TikTok. They now have swag and they have Dutch bro all within like five minutes of each other. Yeah, that's fine. Thank you. You too. Let's do a quick little Target haul. Uh, I'm gonna have pulled pork sandwiches. So I have buns. I am out of my favorite lash, Kiss Lash number 11. So there's that. And then I saw a recipe on TikTok and it's basically like Thanksgiving in a crock pot. What we're gonna do is we're gonna put chicken in the crock pot. We're gonna season it with your basic seasoning. You mix a little bit of sour cream, not vegan. I wish it was, but my target is not a super target. So baggers can't be choosers. That regular sour cream, cream of chicken soup. You mix that together. You put it on top of the chicken. I am a big stuffing girl at Thanksgiving. You may not be, but I am. And I asked Casey if he would eat this, and he said yes. So we'll go either underneath or on top of this, and then green beans. Drain it, put it on top, season it a little more, and then you got yourself basically Thanksgiving in a crock pot. I will probably do this this weekend for Football Sunday, because we got some other stuff to eat in the fridge. And of course, Target trip is complete without oat milk, because we're out. Now all we have is that creamer that I showed you. Good morning. So it's Thursday, welcome to I'm calling it admin day. I did not sleep great. I was gonna go out and get a coffee. It's late now and I have an eye doctor's appointment later. I'll just have admin day at home. Who and I are gonna make a latte. This, toasted marshmallow. A bunch of these Dolce pods. So I think I'm gonna use one of these and make a latte. But basically today's agenda, we have to make two thumbnails for two videos that I have going up on Tuesdays. So we're gonna start editing this video to go up Friday. I'm just gonna do a couple days in my life, nothing crazy. I just swapped into a turn for tomorrow. And tomorrow night, I guess we're going to a Halloween party. So I need to figure out a Halloween costume for Casey to wear. We'll see what I can put together, if I can put together any. All right, we're gonna go a little out of order. I still haven't eaten yet. But I am going to run to Target because I think what I'm going to do is have Casey dress up like Joe from Princess Diaries and I will go as Mia. I have a white dress already. It's not like a fancy white dress. It's just kind of like 
a sundress, but I'm gonna go to Target and see if they have anything. I think I'll be able to get gloves, but I can at least get a crown and then I have just have like a white dress that I could wear. And that'll be that, it's gonna have to be that because I'm not trying to spend more than like $10. And then I have headphones and sunglasses already to wear. So let's go on an adventure to Target. I go to Ross to look there. They have like a kid's play set. And I was thinking like gloves, a wand, and a crown came in like a set when I was a kid. So I tried there, I tried Dollar Tree, neither had anything. But I did get a brush for my layovers because I need a better brush. And I got a green sweater for USF. It's just green, there's nothing on it, and it was $10. So those are the two things I got at Ross. So let's go and Target and see if we can find anything for this costume. Y'all, I think that's one of the most embarrassing trips I've ever had to Target. So, Target, for whatever reason, does not have any like regular little girl crowns. And then I go to check out because I had a wicked crown from Galinda since that's like super popular right now and a can of spray paint to spray paint it. And then the girls at the checkout counter were like, oh, are you gonna like, spray it and I was like yeah but you, you guys didn't have any silver crowns there was a girl who was off but she was like standing there talking to her friend and she worked for Target and she was like did you check the party section and I was like I didn't even think to check the party section so I went to the party section and they had this so this was three dollars and then they had pearls and this was I think five dollars so I'm gonna wear one of these and I'll wear this. I had glue so I could like glue the pearls into this but I don't have glue or a hot glue gun and I'm not gonna buy one so it's gonna be what it's gonna be and that is the costume. We've been DIYing for a little bit. You guys know I got this crown and it was blue. You can kind of still see that the stones are blue. They're peeking through but I have regular milky white nail polish that i am trying to get to kind of like match these pearls that i got from target i think i'm putting i think this is honestly like the fourth coat that i'm putting on i think it's gonna take quite a few coats to like cover this blue but i don't need it to be perfect because it's a halloween party so it doesn't need to be perfect. This crown was like $3. There was one at Dollar Tree that I did almost get, but it had like hearts and stuff on it. And I just, I like this one better. This one looks, I don't want to say more mature because it's a freaking plastic crown, but it, it doesn't look as toddler like as the other one did. I'll probably just do a few more coats of this. Um, it looks really blue in this lighting. I promise it's not, but Oh my god, is my Taylor my Taylor Swift um package is getting delivered right now. FedEx just showed up. I don't know if I'm gonna have to return this one or not, so I need to be very careful with how I open it. Sorry, the UPS truck is here also. I don't think we have anything on UPS though. I like this size. I also ordered it in the bigger size too. This is a more fitted look, but it looks like the Dallas Cowboys. So that's why I got it. Cause it's navy and I thought these were silver, but they're actually light blue. But I feel like they don't look like they're that light blue on camera. All the exciting stuff is done for today. And I have my eye doctor's appointment at four. That's the only thing. That's left. Otherwise, I'm done with all my shopping. I edited the video. I'm gonna add this stuff into it, and that's it.